Hello Taurus, thank you for tuning in to my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support and I send it right back to you guys. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity, what messages do you have for a sign of Taurus? Please and thank you. What messages do you have for a sign of Taurus? Okay, King of Swords starting off with. Mm. Why the King of Swords? This is someone showing up in your current energy, justice and strength. Do you guys have someone fighting for you in order for you to receive justice here in a particular situation? Yes, it looks like you guys are being protected from a situation. It's like um, you'll receive your justice uh, in a situation here. The King of Swords all, always uh, represents like this protective energy. It always reminds me of like Archangel uh, Michael energy here. So it's letting me know, even if you guys are dealing with some sort of legal situation here, it's something that's been burdening you. It's been bothering you for some time or is bothering you or burden, burdening you right now. But with the King of Swords and the Justice here, uh, they're wanting you to know that you are being protected and that this situation will turn out in your favor with the Justice. What's the current blockage showing up for Taurus? What's the current blockage showing up for Taurus? You, self-doubt. You're your own worst enemy right now. You're needing to be more confident in yourself and your abilities here and understanding that you've been guided away. You are constantly being guided away from situations, relationships that just do not serve your highest purpose here. So you're needing to have more faith and trust in that, in the divine, your spirit guides, the universe here. What's the energy coming towards Taurus? Putting that back. What's the energy coming towards Taurus? What's the energy coming towards Taurus? Ooh, growth and expansion. Three of Wands, getting out your comfort zone, exploring a new horizon here. I definitely am getting that you will find yourself investing in something. You have good news in regards to your finances. Page of Pentacles also, if you see how they're like, this pinnacle here has their undivided attention. So something may have your undivided attention in their future here. You guys may have some sort of partnership, some sort of business deal that also comes in. The Three of Wands represents a lot of success, happiness, and growth here. Let's see, what is this page of wands? What has your undivided attention here? You see a lot of uh, possibility of something in their future here. What's the page of pentacles, I mean? What is this page of pentacles representing? Ooh, some sort of investment that's gonna pay off for you big time. King of pentacles represents you achieving some sort of major goal. If you notice the page of pentacles, he turns into the king of pentacles. He's building to become uh, the king of pentacles. So whatever you're aiming to achieve here, because it's like you you may have some sort of idea that you decide to invest in, and it's going to pay off for you big time with the king of pentacles here. King of pentacles is letting you know that you will um, achieve what, whatever level of success you desire to achieve in this situation, Taurus. This is in regards to your finances here. Now, you may also have a partnership showing up as well, but it looks like your finances will be doing very well. Tell me more about the Three of Wands. Tell me more about Three of Wands. Yes. So, I'm really getting, like, you just manifesting your desires, Taurus. There's a lot of growth and expansion here. It's like you just exploring unknown territory here. Um, a lot of new oppor uh, opportunities showing up for you, but you celebrating um, success, having a great time, being around good company as well. I'm getting like you just manifesting all your desires here. The magician represents you being in this energy of knowing that you are more than equipped to tackle any sort of issue or any sort of challenge that is presented to you. It's also you knowing that you're more than capable of having whatever you desire, like you're well equipped to have it. The Four of Wands, feeling very stable and happy as well, feeling supported too. What is the advice for Taurus? 
What's the advice for Taurus? What's the advice? King of Wands. You know, trust your instincts here. Because it does say with the Two of Wands, you you could have a tendency to go back and forth in your head. Like it could take you some time to make a decision or to act on something here. Because the King of Wands is all about action, taking action towards something. So quite possibly you guys may take a little time to um, decide to act on something. They want you to be more decisive. Um, to trust your instincts here, to trust your intuition, to trust in your abilities and certain things here as well. Okay, let's pull from the other deck and we will close this out. Final message for Taurus. Final message for Taurus. energy loss need one more hesitation um Taurus with split energy here what I'm getting is almost like you're physically in one place but your mind is in another place um, which gives like this loss feeling and it causes hesitation as well. Potential. It looks like you're either somewhere or you will be somewhere where there's more opportunities being presented to you. You know, at, quite possibly by this winter for someone here, winter time will be significant for someone. But it's, I don't know why your energy is split. And that's why I'm getting, I'm literally getting like you being physically being somewhere, but then your mind being somewhere else. And it's giving like this energy of feeling lost. It's causing hesitation as well. There's something about this winter where you truly step into your power, Taurus, and you realize your full potential because potential was self-worth here. And this is going to allow so much more opportunities to open up to you. But it's like right now, you're needing to do some healing because your energy is split. Unfocused, multitasking, needing to decide exactly what you truly want. Some of y'all, this is because of past heartbreak as well. But again, that's why I'm getting there's some healing that still needs uh, that still needs to take place in your energy source. But that's by winter time, I definitely am getting like you fully being in your energy, like realizing your full potential here and your self worth here and taking better care of yourself as well. So I'm gonna leave it there. These are the messages that came through for you guys at this time. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, you all take care.